this is where the reality of warfare in the infantry, and that's not decrying anybody else, but warfare in the infantry is pretty grubby. It's pretty, it's pretty lousy. It's, it's dirty, nasty, frightening. It really isn't anything to be enjoyed. You never, ever, while you're involved in the action, think of letting down your trousers and having a little pony and trap. There's no way that you're going to undo your equipment and let your trousers down. So there you are with a, your backside stuck to your trousers and you're thinking, when am I, you know, <laughs> ever going to get a chance to get myself cleaned up? Uh, it, something that the average civilian who sees on the films, these guys rushing into action and they're all pals together. He, he forgets that, yeah, they're, they're, they're also in the position where you're not going to stop for a pee, you're not going to undo your zips, you're not going to do anything like that. There's far too much going on keeping yourself alive. So you are a disgusting, smelly, awful human being. There are men even who are wounded and don't even realise that they're wounded until it becomes a, a step in the battle. It, it is so exhilarating and the fear that surrounds you, the anxiety that surrounds you does not allow you to think of that. The great pictures that you see on the films where there's Harry and Bill and Bill gets hit and Harry cradles him in his arms and says, do not worry, Bill, I will bandage you up. I will... No way, no way, you don't stop your feet for anybody. You don't, you... It's not possible, it's not possible. All you want to do is get into the position you're supposed to get into and you're firing and keeping yourself alive and if somebody gets hit and goes down, the... This is what is the horrifying thing about war. You can hear those blokes, you can hear the lads that have been hit, and everybody, and I mean everybody, when they're hit, always the same thing. Don't leave me, don't leave me, I'm hit, I'm, hey, I'm wounded, I'm wounded, you know. And you can hear his voice as you're in the advance, you can hear his voice going on. Even now, I'm getting a bit out of order now, but even now when I go back to Commonwealth War Graves, when I'm coming out of that, Cemetery, I can still hear voices saying, "Don't leave me! Don't leave me! I'm hit! I'm hit!" You know, and they're the they're the things that make war the terrible, horrible thing. Is you don't start counting how many have been killed or how many have been wounded or anything. Else. You don't know. You're only interested in this is me. Get on with the job. Yeah, shocking. It really, it it really is. It really. There is nothing, nothing anywhere in the world that is worse than walking into the attack as an infantry soldier.